We smoked our fucking body weight in the cast. That's what we did. Like, please the go. blue room, you know. All right, all right. Come to the stage, the very funny Stephen Sane. Hello. Yes. My name is Stephen Sane. In case you didn't get it, it's Steve Insane. I didn't choose the name it was given to me. I'll get how I got the Fakakta name in just a minute. That's not the first word. It's Yiddish, meaning Fakakta, exactly what it sounds like. <laughs> but as Les mentioned, yes, I did graduate from Queens College eventually with a master's degree in something. I started there in 1982. So you still had the blue room next to the bar back in the 70s? I bet it was the same blue couches. The blue room was right next to the bar and it was nice I could go outside and smoke a joint. That's what I pretty much passed the first year there in 1982. Let's get ahead of friend register for me. What are you going to do? That's not really what I came up here to talk about. As I was standing outside earlier, I saw this place that says waxing and relaxing. Those two don't seem to go together. Just an observation. But some people have asked me, like, where have I been? I haven't been like anything comedy related in like two months. That's because I've been busy. I started doing voiceovers, which is eventually going to lead to money. Well, that's what this guy keeps telling me. You do voiceovers, and then you sell the book and the promo codes, and he's talking like 10K a month. So I posted that on Facebook, and a lot of people now want to know what the hell I'm doing. I don't know. But I have done some actual work. Um, did two books. Right now I'm a little confused because I have one project about the vagal nerve, which most people have no clue what that is, but I'm also doing a sex book, and sometimes I get them confused. But it's just, it'll be fun. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I was on a TV show recently. My friend runs a TV show on Queens Public Access Television. So I made him like, put it out there for other comics because I can't keep being on there every month. It's called The Filthy Rich Show. It used to air back in like the 80s and 90s and it even had a really weird review written up 10 years ago. But he just started it back up again. And it was a lot of fun being on TV. But it hasn't been released yet. But I have bootleg video for my phone. It's a kind of a crazy show exactly what it sounds like. Don't get it mixed up with the actual The Filthy Rich Show. Because every time I search for it, that's what I come up with. But I'll put that out to you know, people. Nobody really wants to be on there anyway. I did. So I did two voiceover things you might hear coming up. There's an airline that flies from Los Angeles to Denver. It's called High Airlines. So they had me do the emergency... You're yawning? <laughs> so they had me do the emergency announcement. It kind of goes like this. Ladies and gentlemen, this plane might crash. Your oxygen mask will come out in about five seconds full of happy smoke. Have a nice day. The other one is a commercial for a pretty large restaurant. I'm not sure if this is going to happen, but the commercial went like this. Beep, beep, honk, honk. New drive through at Hooters. Beep, beep, honk, honk. Let's see if that one gets released. I don't know. Maybe. 